Hey guys, welcome to another edition of The Blind Pastor Plays. My name is Derek. I'm a pastor, a multi-time author, I'm a gamer, of course, and I do all this legally blind. But this cross doesn't get me down, and neither should yours. Remember that the Lord's Word in the Bible tells us in 2 Corinthians chapter 12 and verse 9 that the Lord's strength is made perfect in our weakness. Start making whatever you're facing, whatever cross you're bearing, whatever issue you're facing in your life, start using it to overcome. Overcome whatever you're facing. Show others that you can. Be an example to them that God's got your back and you got this. Start using God's will to be a strength in your life today by using what you're facing to overcome. Today we're going to be playing Star Wars Battlefront, the OG Battlefront from 2004, and I'm playing the OG version on the Xbox. But before, and the challenge we're going to go today for this Legally Blind Gamer is to see if I, playing as the Empire, can overcome the Rebels in the Tatooine Dune Sea. Before we get to that, let's go to God in prayer. Heavenly Father, we thank you for this day and for all the blessings that you give us. We pray that the things we do here today will be for faith and fellowship and will always further your kingdom and our growth in you. We pray that the things we say and do here today will be acceptable with thee. We ask that you would be with all those that need you at this hour. Forgive us of our sins, and if we're found worthy, grant us home in heaven. These things we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, guys, here we go. I am not the best at shooters, as you would guess, being legally blind. If you're sitting there wondering how in the world is a blind guy playing Star Wars Battlefront, well, I have a disease called Stargarts I've had since birth. It affects my central vision, but I'm still able to utilize the peripheral vision I have to play games. And I can hold my own in most. Oh, as I go down. The real battle in our life, folks, is what the devil throws our way. James 1 and 12 tells us that blessed is the one that endures temptation. For when they are tried, they will receive the crown of life, which the Lord has promised to those that love him. So if we endure the temptations the devil throws our way, we endure the sin of this life. I'm gonna shoot my own guy. Sorry, man. And we can overcome that. We will have the blessing of a heavenly home. Where are we in our life? Are we overcoming for the Lord, or is temptation getting the better of us? Only you and God know. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Oh man. Oh. Ah. Down here with the. Can I take this command post? Our reinforcements are being depleted. I'm trying. Change. Hurry up, go! Change! Yeah! Alright! We got a command for Oh yeah! Oh yeah! <laughs> How do you do? I come out of the door and goodbye! Oh man! Blew me right out of my shoes! Hey, we got the command post though, right guys? Thank you so much for being with me! I love each and every one of you. You're with me all the way on every one of these challenges. I appreciate it. This is a place where we do all things for faith and fun. And we always put God first with Christ, His Son. If that's what you guys have been looking for, remember to hit a like on this video. It helps us get godly content to others. And subscribe to the channel. 
hit the bell notification. You'll know the next time we make a video. And if you're watching us on Poetically Christian Gamer Twitch, hit the follow button and you'll know when we're live. Gotcha! Gotcha! Oh, oh shoot. <laughs> I gotta help with that one. Whoops. Sorry, man. Sorry. Sorry. My bad. Oh! Oh! I forget how squirrely the aiming is on the original Battlefront game. Have you guys ever played this? Let me know. Were you the EA era Battlefront games? Because this is the OG Battlefront. Back when Battlefront was good. Whoops, did I say that? <laughs> Let me know in the comments if you feel the same way. These games were sweet. So much better. Than what we get now. Gotcha. Oh, I gotta quit doing that rollover. It messes up. It messes you up. The guy like stays in a crouch position and it like just screws with your aiming. Oh! I don't understand. I went in, guns blazing. Whoa! They're right here! Get out of here. I'm running away. <laughs> I run away. And I ran. I ran so far away. Whew. Gotcha! Whoa, I don't know how that didn't get me. I, honest to goodness, I don't know how. Get out of here. Uh, I'm running. Retreat. Oh. Stick and move, stick and move, stick and move, stick and move. Oh, what in the world? That was crazy. I thought I got him. Oh. Oh, man. Oh, this blind guy's holding his own, isn't he? In this battle. Not doing too shabby. Woohoo! Oh yeah, victory! Oh man, oh that was a little rough. We didn't do the best, but we didn't do bad either. Oh, what did we do here? We held our own. Oh, thank you guys for being with me. I appreciate it so much. I love each and every one of you. I thank you every single time you join me on another edition of The Blind Pastor Plays. Remember, folks, you can overcome anything in this life if you only turn to God. Start using your strength. Start using whatever you're facing to be a strength for the Lord today. And remember that no matter what you go through in this life, if you overcome as a Christian, you endure the temptations that the devil throws your way. You will have that heavenly home.
you will have what was promised to you. And that's the crown of life. Thank you so much for joining us. Like I said, remember to like this video. Remember to subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell notification on YouTube. You'll know the next time this blind pastor puts out a video. And if you're watching us over on Twitch, remember to hit that follow button and you'll know when we're live. We've done all kinds of videos in this series of the Blind Pastor Plays, and I appreciate if you'd watch them, like them, share them, and get the gospel and inspire others to overcome what they're facing. Till the next one, guys. Blessed wishes.